Hey guys, I just wanted to show you, um, if you've been following my blog lately, you know that I've redone my mini album. So, I'm almost done with it, and I just can't wait to share it, so. I, um, first of all, used a dollar chipboard album, The Little House, but I ended up cutting off most of the chimneys, except for the cover. Because they were just too difficult to cut the paper around. And then I inked all the pages with Colorbox Dark Brown using a makeup sponge. And these makeup sponges that I used flake a lot. So don't do it over your project, the rest of your project, because you'll get it everywhere. And then, okay, so the covers stay the same if you watched my last video. I used the. <coughs> DCWV pet stack for it. And I used two papers on the front. This paper and then the little roofing is paw print paper. And then this quote a host, a host a house is not a home without a dog is um from somewhere online and then I inked it up with some brown ink. Um, down here I got these bottle cap letters at Big Lots. And then underneath is Martha Stewart Twill Ribbon. And then these eye all the eyelets I used are from Joann's. <coughs> this ring is from Walmart. I still have to add fibers and stuff, I know, but I really wanted to show you guys this. So here's my puppy. Well, he's not a puppy anymore, but he's my dog. And this page has some little rub-ons here. These are from the Joanne rub-ons that Roxy sent me. And then here's um, the glimmer rest I use for these are Peach Delight and Candy Apple Red. And those were also from Roxy. And this little bread of a doggy face is from Roxy. And then a tag. The next page is an interactive page, and I wish and the sun's very bright today, well this morning. But this little chipboard piece says woof woof, and I got that from Roxy, and then these paper clips, really cute bones. So I took some, um, this brown piece is, the dimensions of it are 11 by 3 inches. Then you score at 3, 6, and 9, and then you get a 2 inch overlap for closing, so that was nice. So, sorry, I look close there. This is from the Border Strip. And then this is from Tags to Go by Kane Company that I got from Nikki. And then here's a stamp by Autumn Leaves. And that stamp set's called Quote This. And then there's another tag to go. And then another one up there. So really cute. And then that's another border strip. And this page um, is a photo mat. I really like this paper. This is the border strip paper. I just really like this bottom part here. With the little yard. And then same thing on this side. Um, and then this little charm best friend that I got at Big Lots. This page is another photo mat, um, or a journaling spot, whatever I decide to put there. Okay, that one's not a pocket. This is, um, 3x3. Three three. This is Glimmer Misted with Peach Delight. And it has a little yellow rhinestone there. And then over here, this is covered with craft card stock. And the chipboard piece is by Kane Company. Hey, yet another photo mat. And this one, I know what picture I'm going to put here, so this one will not be empty. Um, the quote is, let sleeping dogs lie, because I have a picture of my dog sleeping on the couch. It's really cute, so that's going there. Okay. This page, another interactive page. There's a craft tag up here with a yellow eyelet and a little paper clip. Then this is a Prima um, Glimmer Mustard with Mustard Seed and has a little gold center there.
and how I made this was I cut out a this paper a six by nine rectangle and then cut out two three by three um squares on each corner and then I um, border punched these edges to give it a little less um dimension I guess it's just yeah and then this was the Fisker's threading or treading water punch and then another border strip and then some velcro that I had so that's a really cute page and then this page is another photo mat I thought this was really cute paper too just really cute and then I still have, to have yet to finish the back because if you saw my last video um, it was all bad back here so that is all gone now and I did switch up the pages if you did watch my last video I think I did anyways I can't remember but and one more thing I just wanted to show you some of my flowers that I've been making So these are these ones. There's these ones. So tell me what you think about them. Um, sorry about that. They're um, just made out of paper. Nothing too fancy about that. But I really like them. Well, I think so. Yeah. Um. So that's it for today, and thanks for watching. Bye.